Hey guys, what's up? It's the Ghastly Gengar, and as you can see, I was doing a cane run. And then 20 minutes into the run, after I died to the third floor boss, I may or may not have died. I'm not actually gonna lie, this is a failed run. I was recording. But, to save you guys the heartbreak and anger of, one, not dealing with the game audio recording, <laughs> and two, making a video more than probably two hours long because there was a failed run mixed into it, because my runs are going to start to end up taking up a lot more time now that I defeated Mom's Heart, I decided to just restart it. I'm sorry, you probably wanted to see it. I honestly was really tired and not knowing what I was talking about, and I don't know if this will make some of you guys upset, but let's just start a new cane run, and I will basically sum up whatever I did say in the last video, or whatever. So basically, long story short, it was me thinking about how unsuccessful I would be if I kept my YouTube name. And the reason why is because when I come up, when I, when I think of YouTubers with their usernames, I don't know how many are truly successful when they have a name like the ghastly gang guy when i think of successful youtubers i think of the jaywitz i th even though i think he's in a pretty tight spot right now i'm not sure don't quote me on that jaywitz fans don't don't strangle me though i i just thought that recently you had to go take up a quote unquote real job um to cover up some of his stuff which, it's fine, you know, people people gotta do what they gotta do. And sometimes that involves going out in the world and fucking pleasuring some soccer mom at a grocery store because all oh, those baby coupons. But it's just when I thought of, when I think of successful YouTubers, I don't think of people who Successful YouTubers who might actually get somewhere, shall I say. And maybe get, like, actual company deals and stuff. I don't... Even though I'm pretty sure these people may have gotten some brand deals in the past, I'm not 100% sure. So, I'm... I just... I don't know. You know what? You know what? Let's just drop it. Let me do what I was doing great last time and narrate this run. Because, damn, I will say... I wasn't, I wasn't, I was going to say I wasn't that proud, but no, it's like I wasn't that upset with how I was narrating the runs. Like, I was focusing on what I was supposed to do, and now I'm immediately stopping that, and it's like, wow, you fucking digressed, dig digressed, is that the word? Receded? I don't know. Dude, it's like, it's nine in the morning. This is the earliest I've been up without having to use an alarm clock or something, I don't know. I'm mumbling, because that's what mumblers do. Alright, so... Let's try not to take stupid damage, because... 9 out of... 9... 100% and 9 out of 10 times. 100% and 95% of the time, that's usually why I die. Oh, hey, Gluttony. Fucking, really? Well, luckily, we're playing a cane run, so... This is going to be too bad. And also, I want to say... This is what... I forgot this is what I was... Oh. Can we become a heart? Can we just get a bunch of heart items and just become a giant beating heart? But, but um, I realized that there was something I wanted to state in the videos, and it was an apology for people. Um, not for just deleting a 20-minute run that was unsuccessful because it was unsuccessful and I was showing my... And because I only want to show my good runs... No, it, bitch, if I wanted to show only my good runs, I'd only have like three episodes of this out. But basically, it was like... I want to apologize to people who truly like my content. Um, I feel bad for going a five-day-a-week upload schedule, where I would upload uh, a video for every weekday, to digressing to only Tuesdays and Thursdays. And I was supposed to be mainly a, like, Nintendo-esque YouTuber, or, you know, I, I don't know. Because, really, now I'm thinking that my name doesn't really 
describe what I do well, but it does define me, myself, pro properly well. Like, I can't come up with a... Like, I, I think I've all told- I told you all how this has taken me. This name took me days to come up with. And you might be thinking, oh, you fucking stupid, you took two Pokemon names, smashed them together, and then made a pun off of it. Yeah, I, I did. But I'm so uncreative, that's what it came down to. Um, so we got a screw right there. Um, I think that's going to probably actually help overall in the end. And I'm actually going to pause the recording right quick, because I need to move something on my setup, and I don't want it making a lot of noise. Sorry about that, I had to move my mic a little bit. And I think I actually made it in more of an awkward position, and as you can hear, I'm fit still fiddling with it a little bit. Um, I think this is good. Uh, from what I see on the audio pickup on the game, and not on the game, but on the recording, it does seem to be coming through alright. Long story short, I'm not sure how well my name to fit my username to fits my fits my channel, other more or as as much as it defines me as a whole, because I really like Gengar. I think he's really cool. Whatever, but I'm not sure if it's one of those cringy ass names, like K Kirito, Sasuke, Britney Spears, XX32, XX, uh, Falcon Lord Lover, you know. I'm not sure if it's just a mismatch of things. I thought it was a nice. I, I thought it was some fun wordplay. Like that's how I looked at it, and I still kind of look at it that way. It's just I don't know if it's ever going to go to a professional standpoint. So at the end, this might just become a personal channel while I actually try come one per professionally. I don't know. I'm gonna keep doing me, but hopefully, my. Hopefully I can get you, uh, long story short, hopefully at some point I can get you guys back on a five video a week schedule and not, you know, fucking destroy everything you hope and love. Actually, I don't know where I was going with that at the end because I was fiddling on my mic for so long. Ooh, attack fly. So what is this, for every enemy I kill I get a fly? Not bad. So I'm gonna go back to narrating these runs like I'm supposed to be. Alright, so we just got a key, so this is definitely gonna come out good in the end. Um, sorry for this sh uh, shift in tone. And I need to fucking adjust the mic again, because this is even more awkward than I was doing before. All right, I think I got this, finally. <laughs> Sorry for so many technical difficulties. It's just I've been sitting down for so long, trying to get shit ready, and now my legs hurt like a bitch. So now I need to try to attempt to lay down and record. And this is not easy. Fucking, I hate it. I fucking hate how I just can't sit in a chair anymore. But hey, that's my life, you know, spiraling out of control. And then being told by everyone else that, Oh, but my life is so much harder. Why do you fucking stop being such a little puss? It's great. Apparently in my life, I can't see bad because people have it worse. But okay, whatever. Let's not dive into that. Alright, so right now we have three hearts. We have a yum heart, and that's pretty good on its own. I think this is only the second floor. We haven't really gotten any kind of damage up, kind of help. And we're facing Dingle. So this might just start off as a failed 9 minute run. Because, if you don't know, Dingle is probably one of the worst bosses I have the most trouble with. And you're probably like, what the fuck's wrong with you? Dingle's like so easy. I know! So that's why I can't comprehend on why I suck fighting Dingle so much. Alright, so it's just random tears become flies. Alright, I'm okay with it. That! Nope. I definitely wasn't getting any devil run rooms. And I'm not really looking for trying to get any devil rooms. Or devil deal rooms. But, eh, whatever. We still left the floor with full health, so. Now it's time to get, like, two health down pills. Alright, pretty fly. 
Tears down. I mean... Fucking really? <laughs> wow, it's really early and I'm already screaming like this and I feel like I'm gonna piss some people off. Oh well. So, let's try to get through this room without fucking everything up. And since we have luck down now, I feel like this run's gonna get a lot harder. Because I'm pretty sure the luck, like, aspect of Kane actually made this a lot easier than it was supposed to be. Also, I was thinking, um, because uh, a streamer named Vine Sauce Vinny has actually been playing this and talking about it recently. And it's a game called Enter the Dungeon. Dungeon? I don't, I'm not sure if I said that right the first time. But it's basically a rogue-esque dungeon crawler just like this. And it's, I think, a lot more detailed. I'm not sure. I've only seen, like, half of a run of it. I just know that you play... It's basically Isaac with guns. Guns and lots of bullets. And a link to the past reference. Which, I mean, I'd be completely okay with. Um, why did my attack go up? No, oh, well, it's down... It went back down anyway, so I don't know why I'm worrying. Well, if you guys would be interested in seeing an Enter the Gungeon run, um, I can see what... I can, I can see you about getting the game. I can't guarantee that I can get the game, but if I do get the game, I probably will do a few runs of it and just kind of try to get a feel overall what, you know, if people just like it, you know? So one of the things we have right now is uh, the red patch. I don't know necessarily if it's worth holding on to. But there's no reason to get rid of it quite yet because it's just adding a little effect onto us. Um, I just know that randomly it just makes us do the Pac-Man slash bull thing. So I'm going to keep it for now. Don't know how in hand... Uh, maybe, I don't know. Does it do that? Because I might be confusing the last run with this run. Bomb? Yeah, that's right. Hook me up. Um, one thing I don't want to do is rely too much on... Uh... So, the practice. I did a practice run before this. Um, I did it on the first save file. And I was playing as Kane. And at some point, the game was just becoming really stingy with bombs. So I had to rely on using a Bob's head. Which... I mean, it's not too bad since it only has a char like a three charge rate. But at the same time, if you don't have that many rooms with enemies in it, you don't get many uses out of it. Um, let's see, can we get something out of the shop? Let's see, I don't, I, I don't like really buying items on runs. I don't know what that does. Um, I'm gonna pick it up. I, even, I just said I don't like picking up items on runs. But it's basically like, I don't know if I should be putting more money into the bank, or what. Come on, four more, four, you just give me four please. Five, I mean, I guess. More active item room. Oh, so I get another, like, okay. I, I'm not upset I'm with that. I just don't know if, like, Using shop room items are usually it's like the most viable thing to do because usually when I go in there it's usually just a map or steam sale like there's not usually the best items in there and I don't know if in the past run we've actually like used a shop item that helps that actually helped us get the win. 
Because we've only beaten, a, we've only beaten like what three runs so far? Two, not even two runs. We've beaten two runs so far, and so far I don't think either one of them had a fuck. I really want that chest. Um, had a impact from the shop. So we're gonna go and try to find a bomb now. Because I really want that red chest. Because red chests are good. I mean, they're not... The odds of me getting something good from that chest are extremely low, I think. And I just want to at least make sure that I can get... Get everything I can at this point. Because I would really like some damage up. Even though I'm not guaranteed a damage up item. I still would like to go and try for it. Kind of like how I like to go try for brimstones all the time. But I've only successfully done that once. And even then it wasn't really successful because uh, that run ended pretty badly. So I'm trying to make sure that these spiders don't mess me completely up. Bomb? Fucking key. Well, at least we know for the next few floors, we're not going to have to worry about missing any items. So, I guess that's an upside. So, let's go into the boss room now. My mouth is really dry. Like, has anyone else just woken up with an extremely dry mouth? And no matter how much they drink, they still get thirsty. Like, I'm sitting here with a bottle of water and every... Fuck! Not Black... Not... Not Widow! No! I suck at this boss. Fucking hell! And the slowdown of the game is real right now, like... I hate that my computer is fucking chugging on such an easy-to-run game. Really need a better computer. Too bad computers for proper gaming cost, like, upwards of a thousand dollars! And I'm a fucking broke-ass boy. Hopefully once we take out one of these widows, we still are able to... It, it will lower... Okay. So will the game start running faster now that it's gonna be dead? No, I think it's not gonna be running a bit faster until we get out of this room. Or until we beat this... Alright, so that... That's the best. Where's the item? You know, this box of stuff. Oh, a bomb. Whipworm. Okay. Okay, shot speed up. I thought we had more backpack space. What? No. I think the Empress takes us to the boss room. Wait, so what was the backpack for? The backpack literally does nothing. So... I think I'm going to go with the whipworm because it gives us more shot speed. But if you could tell me what the hell the uh, the backpack does, let me know. Let me know in the comments. Hey, you know what? That's not bad. Technically, technically a little bit of attack. So tired still. But I still got to get all the shit done. So, for those of you who don't know, my setup is basically a, uh, I'm not saying this to be like, oh my god, pity me, my setup is horrible, nah, but I'm complaining more of the, okay, I don't know why I was continuously shooting, uh, I'm complaining more of the fact that my setup makes it extremely hard to clean up my room. So, I do have a corner where I could have a TV, but instead I have my, I I've said this before, like, multiple times, uh, my TV is on... A cat stand or a cat tree next to my bed and I have it taped to the top and I have my actual computer right next to it 
And then next to that, I have a table with a TV on it because my actual TV fucking imploded it on itself and just refuses to work. With anything HDMI, at least. So, if I want to play my PS4, my PS3, my Xbox One, my Wii U, or anything, fucking... I have to play it on this little little small TV. Um, and I, I, I do like the TV, I'm not gonna lie. Like, it's okay. But when it comes to using it as a computer computer monitor or like, um, what else? A computer monitor or sometimes for games, the resolution gets really fucked up. Like, I can't watch YouTube videos on it because, like, it makes it so ha- I think it make, thinks the res- I think it, uh, when I'm using a computer or something on it, it makes the t- or the- console think that it's using a, a bigger resolution than it actually is so there's a huge like cutoff like no matter what like if I'm using my PlayStation or my Wii I can have um, I, I'll have like because they have those consoles have like a thing where you can like shrink or enlarge on how big the screen resolution is or like not how how big the safety space of the screen is which means like what is in bounds of your TV or not and even though I have that set up perfectly on my TV, no matter how small I make it, for some reason it just like, you know, yeah, your TV is way bigger than this. Let's let's cut off your videos. <laughs> but my TV setup, my TV, and my computer setup that I have makes it extremely hard to uh Come on. Come on. I think we're going to take that because no. No! We're gonna test this out for- Oh! What? How do we- Oh my god, this is amazing! Never mind! Now I wonder, if it's like in the background, does it still charge? So... What did I just do? What happened? What? Did I have a card? Did I just waste a card? I pressed triangle. I think I just wasted a card. Fuck. That sucks. I pressed triangle. Next thing I know, I'm a fucking giant devil. What? Um, so let's try to find this item room. Right? Yeah, we need to find the item room still. Ah, oh, man. I don't really mind that cash. Uh, if we get, like, maybe a hanged man card or something, I'll come back for it. Fuck, that was a horrible mistake. But now I... Oh, shit. I'm surprised I didn't take damage from that in the end. Flies, do your thing. Yeah, it's, I think it still gets a charge. I've been really Larry Jr. I mean, these flies, they do some decent damage, not gonna lie. I'm kinda glad that we got that fly item. I'm not 100% sure on if I've picked it up before, if it's a normal item. Alright, yeah, the item's charged in the background, which is a 10 out of 10 in my book if I've ever seen it. What is that? Damage down tears. Wait. God, fuck! I always thought uh, fucking. <sighs> well, guys, rip this run. If you like, my, if you like the video, comment down below. Fucking god damn it. Like, out of all the fucking items, really? I had to get this one? Why can't I just learn what items do and what they look like? Oh, 
big fly friend. I kind of want big fly friend. I know that I won't get enough coins. Dang it, that was a waste. So hopefully I can maybe get a hangman card or something at some point. I mean, at least now we get a lot more attack flies. That seems, at least that's what it seems like. Uh, yeah, I don't think we're gonna be getting an uh, getting a hangman card, and if we do, boy, we are really pushing our luck. Fucking... Oh. This room sucks. Come on. You wouldn't be so much a problem if these assholes... <laughs> well, this is supposed to be a joke, but it ended up being one. Just stops flying into areas where it can't get them. And this sucks even more. Fucking... I just had to get soy milk. I just had to pick up soy milk. I don't know how well this is gonna end up because I... I, I believe the last one we had soy milk, it ended up pretty badly. So let's switch to Bob's head, because at least that way we can get some damage in on the boss. Since we're obviously not going to be getting any damage in with soy milk. <laughs> and I can't go anywhere else. Well, I mean... I just really want Big Fly Friend. Like, But I know I'm not going to be able to get it, so I might as well put these five coins away. And now watch, after I put these five coins away... I'll be able to get Big Fly Friend. Actually, no. Now, I'm, now I lost coins in my bank. I should really start saving more in the bank. So let's let's just lose this run already. All right, let's just. Uh, I mean, actually, all right, we might be able to pull this off. It just depends on how much these flies are actually going to go towards Gertie. Not going to lie, the mixture of the flies and soy milk is actually okay. It's just that I think the actual damage down is affecting the flies. Either that or Gertie just has a lot of health for some reason. I mean, hey man, if we get some more fly items, I think we could actually become the fly. And that would be a very interesting run, not gonna lie. If we could become the fly, I would gain all faith in this run again. Actually, if we got big fly friend, we might actually be able to get the, the fly. Shit. That was my bad, sorry. matchbook so oh shit fucking dick so we didn't get any coins and there is no arcade on this floor um I could try to go find a hidden room at, but there are three locations for one that could be right here can be up here actually if I look at the room layouts maybe yeah it's definitely not here but could be in the next area in the shop. Let's try here. Okay, it's not there. 
Um, it's not in the- okay, so it's- I think- no, it can't be here either. Fuck. Um, you know, let's try. Let's try here. Yeah, even though I'm pretty sure it can't be in the boss room. Yeah. Well, I wasted your time and I wasted two bombs, but luckily we still have Bob's head. And if we get rid of anything, it might be Yumheart. Uh, depends on if. See, I don't know what's happening. Like, I just start a floor automatically firing tears, and I don't know why. Yeah, I'm not doing so hot. There's just so many tears going in every direction. So we somehow made it through that. Well, then there's this. We can get. Uh, I want to say get a petrified poop, but I think the shot speed up and the soy milk is pretty okay. It's just that we need more damage. We need damage or else this run is going to go bad. Like, there's no way this run's gonna end okay with the damage we have now. So we would need something like, maybe, Cricket's Head. Or another Fly Item. Sorry for the slowdown, it just sucks. I mean, I know. Come on. There we go. Paralysis. Why? Just drop that. If we had a way to get to those fires, I wouldn't mind trying to bomb them. Let's not go there for yet. This room is horrible. Fucking... This room was going to be the death of me. Well, I would pick up another run if we were just going to mom, our mom's heart, but, I mean, literally, if I were to do a full-on run or attempt one, I think the video would be longer than maybe two hours. It's actually maybe going an hour and a half. You know what? I'm going to go on the benefit of the doubt and say that we're probably going to be another unsuccessful run. So you guys are going to get two, basically two runs in one day. Also, I don't know why this game is having so much slowdown right now. And of course, Pride. Hangman. Death. Okay. Don't know why I'm still wishing for Hangman, because there's no way I'm getting that golden poo now. I mean, we were so close to a fly, the being the fly, I think, right? I know for Guppy, I think it's like three Guppy items. 
Two bombs. Oh. This one's being a lot less stingy with the poo. Oh, not the poo. The... The bombs. So, let's see how well this goes. So, I think I've lost maybe a total of four runs already. Which sucks. I might have to restart the recording. Alright, I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna restart this recording so that way we stop having this nasty slowdown. So I'll be right back. No, don't delete. Alright, so I think I fixed it. It looks fixed for now. Hope that doesn't affect anything later in post. So, I'm actually going to put up the F7 for now, just so I can keep track of some stuff. Um, I would like to go to the shop, but at the same time, I I'll wait till we have the access money and keys, so I'm not wasting too much stuff. So hopefully we don't get another... Um, double boss like widow or something because that screwed up my frames and the uh, how fast the game is running really bad so okay gemini we, okay so for the run that failed and then there's this one or the last one it, we've been getting gemini for like three times in a row and i'm pretty okay with that so i gotta keep in mind that we already have half an hour of recording so I gotta make this fast, cause I don't want you guys. I don't want to take up too much of your guys' time. I mean, if anything, I could just cut it into two parts and upload it. Like, I'll upload them both at the same time. Uh. What is... We got a lot of the same items, and it's kind of weirding me out. I, I, didn't, I didn't notice any legit rocks on this floor, so let's just move on. We gotta get this recording done. Like, I could have just stopped at the last episode, but now I want to give you guys something good to watch. Also, my fucking thing's doing the thing again. I think I might need to unplug and replug my controller in. Or I can attempt my uh, playing with my Xbox One controller, which is what I was practicing with the other night. Um. Yes, Penny, glide upon glide upon the poop, Penny. If I had a petrified poop, this would be great. Must be perfect. Like, I like petrified. <laughs> I, I like the item petrified poop. It definitely helps out a lot. I'm kind of disappointed we didn't get it there. Oh shit! Oh, we need a heart. Actually, you know what? Yep, that's all I'm willing to put effort into. Because there's no way I'm actually going to fully on it. Um, there's no way I'm going to attempt doing that stupid room. So let's do that. Sorry, so now this, the run is being kind of stingy on bombs. Or not bombs, keys. And we're getting a lot of bombs. Well, no, I can't say it's really stingy on keys because it's only the second floor. It's being really grateful of bombs. But I can't say it's being stingy with keys. All stats up. 
I don't know what that did, honestly. I would, I would have loved an all stats up by now. Like, that'd be good. I'd be okay with that. Yeah, I ain't, I ain't gonna risk losing a run on a stupid room like this. Sorry. Luckily, I didn't waste that on Sloth. Or not Sloth. Gemini, like I was thinking. We have a shot, but I don't know if it's going to be worth grabbing now. Because we don't have the extra key, really. When we do, it's just unless we, unless this room drops another key. I don't think we're going to be going. Also, while we're in here... Nice. Fuck. The one thing that make... Well, one of the things that make fucking Kane stick out and we just got rid of it. Whoops. Huh. Well, I was thinking that it might have given us the lucky toe, but now I'm kind of upset that it did not. Okay, so let's... I'm not... What does this item do? I kind of wish um, this mod worked with, like, a description mod or something, but I can see why it doesn't. Maybe I wish there was an item that like you could pick up that would fully describe the what ha what what items do for you. Also, fucking Dingle. So this might be even a shorter run than I thought. I really don't like you, Dingle. I really don't like you, Dingle. Red bomb leave a poop. I'm getting greedy for damage. So now watch, we're gonna go to the next floor, and for some reason I'm just gonna start it just shooting a bunch of tears. Like I I put the alright, I put it I'm putting the controller down. I'm gonna press X just to skip the cutscene. Wow, fucking really? Now it just makes you look like a fucking liar. Alright, cool, whatever. Fine. You do you. Do my frames go down again? It's not. Greed heads. Right? I think that's what these things are called. I don't know how I lived through that, but I'm glad that I did. Alright, let's get rid of these fires, because this is definitely a danger hazard. Like, I don't think the farts themselves can hurt me, but I think they can just push me into stuff, right? Yeah. Let's try to get some damage up. And uh, for now on, I'm just going to always avoid soy milk. I just need to remember what soy milk looks like, because I thought it looks like almond milk for some reason. So we're not we're not getting too many good items on this. Not gonna lie, like this. Like I like the reference, but I, it doesn't mean that's a good item. Like, cool. I just realized it's so that that reference is so old that this there's probably a generation of kids who've already forgotten about the shoop to loop. You say waste. I say I had no choice.
I need a heart. I need a heart, I need a heart, I need a heart. Stars. I don't remember what that does. Mushroom item? Pill. I'm gonna try going for a mushroom. I know the chances are very slim, but... We got a lot of pills. Okay. Alright. Amnesia. Found nah. pills and I ate them. So, they, okay, so we got three pills in a row and they aren't, they aren't really bad pills, not gonna lie. They're okay. Like, they don't really affect us other than, like, visually. But we're going to have to go into this boss now with only one heart. So, this... Fuck. Well, luckily we got fucking 48 hour energy. So let's, let's do that again, but not suck. Man, now I really wish I kept the stars. But then again, like, hey, if I didn't use it, I was I would have never known. It's just I should have used it a lot smarter. So this boss isn't too hard. It's just you gotta remember where the hell they're gonna pop up. Like that, I lost track of that one. Well, I was worrying about saving time, but in the end, but whatever. I still got you guys your run, and even though they came out a little shit, I mean, we didn't do too bad. Actually, we did horrible in Binding of Isaac terms. But I hope you guys enjoy the video nevertheless, and if you liked the video, hit the like button down below. Comment down below how much of an idiot I am and how bad I am at Isaac, because I don't know that already. And um, I think that's really about it, so until next time, I hope you all have a great day. And bye-bye.